Whatever plans you have booked in the next couple of months, cancel them. There's something much more important coming up where you have to be on your tiptoes waiting for the lunch. Titanic Submarine Season 2. <laughs> Billionaire shares a plan for a $20 million sub -vo voyage. What the fuck is this word? To Titanic site to prove the industry is safer after the Ocean Gate disaster. 74 year old American businessman from Ohio, Larry Connor, with a net worth of $2 billion, phoned up a submarine company just a few days after the tragedy, asking them to design another submarine to prove the Titanic disaster was a one off. If in June of last year you decided to take time off the internet to go into nature, meditate, touch some grass, kiss some trees, then you probably missed the news about the five people who got unalived when they decided to go take a road trip to the titanic with ocean gate ocean gate ceo and a bunch of other billionaires decided to take a road trip last year to go experience life to the fullest by visiting the titanic in the ocean gates one of ocean gate submarines controlled by what a playstation xbox type of controller what happened to them was on the second day the people who were controlling the ocean started hearing bank noises some things going on there were no communication between them and they were reported missing on the second day and i believe it was the fourth or the fifth day they were declared dead that they said on the first or second day they just exploded into pieces the submarine uh, ocean gate could not handle it now you're probably like oh my god billionaires are so bored they don't know what they're doing with, with their lives they should donate their money to me they're stupid they're stupid stupid people this is where i come and tell you that you are wrong as a person who identifies as a billionaire i have the mindset you get any woman you want in the world you get any supercar you get the mansions you get the yachts you go and travel you have ice cream in italy like a five thousand pound ice cream there is nothing left for billionaires to do they have experienced life 99 percent there's that one percent comes in where you know they start doing stupid shit like going in a submarine paying like i don't know i think it was five million dollars a ticket to go down to just watch a titanic from a screen or from a monitor I, I don't really remember so as a person who identifies as a billionaire you will get to a point in life where money does not matter to you anymore and life has no value you basically become stupid now mr 74 year old billionaire larry was so offended the fact that people were like oh my god these people who go and dive are so stupid and he wanted to prove a point just a few days after the titanic incident last year larry decided to team up with a submarine company called triton triton submarines and he said he will be going on a mission and will make the journey of 20 million dollar two-person submarine this 20 million dollar investment is going to build a submarine built for two people and can dive down up to 4,000 meters where the titanic is i believe uh, 3,800 meters and they call it the 4,000 slash 2 abyssal explorer now this larry isn't a first timer who wants to experience life he's actually been diving a lot he also dived in the mariana trench which is the deepest ocean and what is his reason for all of this he basically said quote unquote i want to show people worldwide that while the ocean is extremely powerful it can be wonderful and enjoyable and really kind of life changing if you go about it in the right way i'm sure it can be very life changing once you start experience the ocean you go and you face a great white shark or you experience the fucking creatures down in the ocean because god knows how many are there that we have still haven't discovered yet or if you go in your 20 million dollar submarine and it just decided to once you go too deep decided to put you into pieces i'm sure it's very life ending i mean life changing now i don't know about you but i fucking hate the ocean i can't even when i go in the sea sometimes when i'm like tanning i get naked i oil up i lay down once i like i want to refresh my body i go inside the ocean a little bit i shake it and once i'm inside the ocean once i see that even the tiny fish is going around my feet i get freaked out I run immediately out like a bitch. If you want exciting things, Mr. Larry, swimming pools are the best thing. You can go to, I don't know, 200 feet uh, deepest swimming pool here in Dubai. Now, jokes aside, fuck the ocean. I, I don't know why people go risk their life once they're like worth two billion dollars if i was a billionaire i would sit at home i will go out to very safe places and enjoy my life you need to love your life not risk it unnecessarily for a 
a drill in a rush. Now, I wasn't always boring and an old man like this. I used to ride motorcycles. I used to be like uh, dumb in the head. I used to speed. I also escaped death. But it is all over now. At 25 years old, I will never do anything like that again. Even people who skydive. Yes, if you skydive, I'm talking to you. Why? Why? You want to gamble with your life? You want to jump out and be like, excitement, my life is so fun. You want to get a GoPro footage so you can post it on your Instagram and be like, guys, look, I'm such a fun person. Fuck your fun. Your life is worth more than a Instagram story. Now, Larry decided to collab with this submarine company, this guy called Patrick Leahy. Apparently, he's a he was a first person to dive the Challengers deep twice with going into like Mariana Trench. Basically, he's experienced in these things and he's been doing to get he's been doing it for a very long time. Larry and Patrick are going to be the two people sitting in that $20 million AI. I'm assuming he has AI because it's $20 million. Sitting in that and going down to the Titanic and showing people that ocean is fun. Meanwhile, no one really gives a shit i don't know why i'm so angry stir money stir life but they're extremely stupid for this now the ceo of the submarine patrick has been thinking about designing it this for over a decade but we didn't have the materials and the technology you couldn't have built this sub five years ago but they're about to build it in the coming next month because now apparently they have the material and the technology and what i found hilarious is when they both came and they said that the ocean gate submarines because these are two different submarine companies a triton and uh, ocean gate they're like ocean gate they had skill issues they didn't know what the f they were doing. We know. They literally shut on the <laughs> ocean gate because the CEO died and the whole company fell apart, I'm assuming. They said the pair compared the doom of ocean gate sub ribble to a contraption. <laughs> if you don't know what contraption is, it means skill issues. Now, they haven't set a date yet. All we know is they have the materials and they have the technology to finally develop. What the f <clears throat> But let me show you the animation of what happened to ocean gate the second they went down there this is what happens to you when you go too deep and the submarine that has never been tested before is about to get tested you will go straight into pieces with a blink of an eye you meet your maker it, it's basically a one blink first class straight ticket to hell or heaven depending on what you did with your billions none of us really expected the season two titanic submarine series coming out but hey it is here and it's going to be very entertaining i feel like what they need to do to take it to the next level for everyone to have the experience is they need to live stream it on twitch they need to put a camera and a microphone inside and just talk through the things hey guys we are at 1800 feet right now thank you jimmy for the five dollar donation mark coming in with a 50 gifted w's in the chat w's and then they're gonna go all the way and they're gonna fucking explode and then that might be the end of season two but we never know because there's a lot of billionaires out in the world and there might be season three so do not lose hope imagine they actually go there and they actually make it out they record the whole thing, and then once they come back, they're going to look like heroes. They're going to do a slow motion walk to a 21 Savage song. What was that song, uh, Red Rum? Me and my twin, something like that. But anyways, just wanted to update you with the season two. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Take it for yourself. I'll see you in the next one.